And now, Gary Finch Outdoors, brought to you by Dixie RV Superstores. Hi, folks. While you're fishing for red snapper this season, you can give thanks to an artificial reef program that was started over 50 years ago. Alabama has kind of seen since the uh, late 1950s when uh, our local Orange Beach Fishing Association uh, partnered with the state to build some artificial reefs out of uh, used or old automobile car bodies. Um, uh, since that point forward in time, Alabama went from uh, hardly any production of red snapper to at one point not too long ago to being the, uh, the number one state in the Gulf of Mexico uh, as far as uh, landing red snapper recreationally. Offshore here was basically flat mud bottom. It was barren. And the, the state of Alabama had the foresight to start this program and the artificial reef program is one of the largest in the world and it's highly successful. The red snapper fishery that we have is world class. And Alabama has, by using this private artificial reef program, has discovered something that nobody else knows. That if you build an artificial reef and you manage it, you just catch a few fish off of it, that reef will continue to produce fish year after year after year. To find artificial reefs in your waters, Check with your state's Marine Resource Division. I hope everyone has great luck and a happy and safe Memorial Day weekend. I'm Gary Finch for WKRG News 5. Catch more of Gary Finch Outdoors every Sunday morning over on, on WKRG at 5 o'clock and right here on the Gulf Coast CW at 930.